I want to ask you is why? why as the old colloquialism says God don't like ugly all right and if God don't like ugly guess what he may love you but he may not like you all right now it's not about looks it's about what's in your heart one of the things I noticed that's really ugly y'all mm -hmm, is I'm hearing all these people talk about these Haitians every time you turn around Haitians eat cats and dogs Haitians do this Haitians do that now I don't care what you think your your religious stance is but I'm gonna tell you right now that is nothing but prejudicial nothing but prejudice that's all that is so what I want you to think about is think about how that makes people feel you know that stuff has been going on for centuries especially when you look at one race or another race trying to feel superior to other races it doesn't make sense because God created us all equal correct all right so if you look at let me wind these windows up if you look at how God created us equal picture the human race as a bouquet of flowers bouquet book bouquet whatever picture us as a bouquet of flowers you've got roses they're all the same species of flower but you've got red ones white ones blue ones purple ones all different kind of colors and yellow orange I mean the list goes on ad infinitum almost especially when you can play with the with the um I forget what you call it some way that you water the rose and you can actually add color to the petals really interesting what I wonder is if you close your eyes and took a whiff would you know which color you were smelling think about that that's number one number two if you felt it against your skin while you're inhaling that beautiful aroma would you know what color you were feeling and smelling would you no all right so get up off your high horses and quit trying to compare one thing to another here's another bone i have to pick with you everywhere i look online you can see a, a latino an asian a white a brown an indian whatever but you come up with a black person and they must be labeled black. What is up with that? What is up with that? It's almost as if it's a strategic, systematic way of keeping us singled out for some reason. I don't get that. Okay, let's lay that aside. Here's another one. <laughs> All right, if you wonder what I'm talking about, let me make a quick example. If you see a movie about... Uh, or a story being read about cops messing with somebody if it's a Caucasian woman an Asian woman a Latino woman or whatever you will have them say cop harasses old woman that is the only indication you will get about who they are what they are what what kind of person they are male or female old or young that's about all you're going to get but if you deal with a racial identification they feel like they are obligated to identify the black person as black that is the first identification you're going to hear my question to you is why, why?